There are only two buttons left, the delete character and the main obstacle area. Delete character is pretty simple. If you click it by itself, nothing happens. What you need to do is highlight a character, and once he's highlighted, then click delete character, and it'll ask you if you want to get rid of him or not. If you do, say yes. If you don't, say no, and that's the end of him. Finally, we encounter the main obstacle area. Now this button brings up a window that's very much like the story engine elsewhere in Dramatica. It's a simplified version with only those story elements that pertain directly to the main character, the one who represents the audience position in the story, and the obstacle character, the one who represents the opposing point of view, belief system, or paradigm. What it allows you to do is to make structural choices about the overall story from a character perspective. For example, I might decide that I want to pick out my main character's problem, and I'm presented with an entire list of all the potential problems that the main character might be driven by. Suppose this character is driven by his faith. Having selected that, the story engine has now predicted the solution to too much faith is to disbelieve. It's also begun to put some limitations on what the other choices can be because only certain kinds of stories will revolve around a character driven by faith. While going down to the obstacle character, I might decide to select that the unique ability that makes the obstacle character uniquely able to possibly change the main character's belief system. Out of all the characters, this is the one because of this unique ability. And what is it? In this case, it's the fact that they're very open. They have such openness that it causes this character to question their faith. And by choosing something for the obstacle character and something for the main character, Dramatica's story engine has begun to predict what some of the other dramatic elements need to be. For example, the main character's thematic issue, the central issue, is dream. So it's because the main character is concerned with dreaming thematically that an obstacle character whose thematic issue is choice, whose unique ability is openness, they will be able to be uniquely able to make the main character question his or her faith. So as we've done this, the number of story forms or story structures remaining has dropped from 32,768 to only 32 structures that will fit with the choices we've already made. The choices that are in regular block letters those we've made explicitly. The ones that are in italics, those were made by the Dramatica Story Engine implicitly. By cross-referencing what we have determined, it has determined other things. And that, in fact, is the heart of the function of the Dramatica software itself. To learn more about how the Story Engine functions and how to use it, you want to explore the Story Engine demonstration elsewhere in this program. But for now, we've had a brief taste of the range and power of the tools Dramatic has available for character creation and development.